it's Angel Eleanor here and I hope that you are doing so well and having an amazing day or night wherever you are on this beautiful planet. In today's video, yes that's right, maybe a surprise to some of you beautiful people, I am making a video about makeup. Makeup, makeup, makeup. Why I used to wear makeup, why I stopped wearing makeup, and just a bit about my history with it in hope and trust that it may inspire and help some of you beautiful people. So, before I get started, as always, I want to give a huge shout out to all of my amazing supporters on my Patreon. Shout out to you guys, all of the new Patreon members as well. Shout out to everyone who's supporting me on PayPal and shout out to all of you amazing, beautiful souls who are my clients. It is a pleasure to work with you guys. So, why did I stop wearing makeup for two years and what did I learn from that? Well, let me just start by saying, I started wearing makeup when I was just 12 years old, okay? And the reason I started wearing it when I was just 12 years old, because that's quite young, I felt peer pressure. I started developing skin problems with puberty very young and when I got to around 12 you know what I just thought I cannot bear to even leave the house knowing that there were some problems with my skin I would cake my face in foundation concealer and everything and I was just 12 that's right and for me, this lasted for a long, long time. Like, I literally could not leave the house. I did not want to leave the house as a 12-year-old unless I was wearing a whole face of makeup. This lasted till I was about 15 years old. Old. And when I got to around 15, or I think it was 15 and a half, around that time, I stopped wearing makeup and I was makeup free for around almost two whole years. When I stopped wearing makeup, I learned to love myself the way that I am. That is so important. And when I stopped wearing it for two years, I learned to embrace my inner beauty and my outer beauty just as it is. Learning to recognize and accept yourself is one thing that so, so many people in today's society have trouble doing. And that's a fact. Look around you. Look on social media. People's Instagram posts. People who wake up every day and the first thing they do. No offense. Is th if this is you, no offense. And the first thing they do, prioritize, makeup. Number one priority. And this is just, in my experience and my honest opinion, this is not right. Because you are a beautiful soul. And I know that if you're a male and you're watching this, this may not apply to you. But if you have a wife, a partner, children, who you know are around you and maybe doing this sort of stuff, then maybe you could share this with them as well, OK? 
okay? You know, when it comes down to why people really, really feel the need to cover up their own beauty, right, the way that God made you, to almost make themselves look like everyone else, you know, the same shaped eyebrows, you know, everything, contour, perfect, like whatever perfect really is. Because in my eyes, perfect is just how you are. And so when I went through these two years of no makeup, right? One of those things that I learned as well is that it's okay to be creative, right? Do you like coloring? Because I love it. And makeup art is honestly amazing, right? I mean, just look at some of the amazing things you can do with colors, whether you're painting, you're drawing, or you're drawing on your eyes. Like, makeup art can be fantastic, don't get me wrong. I myself, I love it. And that's another thing I wanna go into, you know. Nowadays, I don't wear foundation. I haven't wore actual foundation for the last almost four years, actually. Um, and when I did wear something on my face, I, I used a tiny bit of powder. And you know, something I've actually tried lately, which is awesome, an amazing alternative to actually using powder on your face is pearl powder. I'm not even kidding you. You can get powders that are made from 100% pearls. Yes, pearls. And it is inexpensive and it is actually healthy for your skin. So you can either use it as a face powder, it's translucent, and it actually blurs the pores naturally, and it's not clogging your pores, and it's not harmful for your skin, and it's not filled with tons and tons of chemicals. So pearl powder is such an amazing alternative to face powders and foundation in general. And yes, it is translucent, so there's not much coverage, but however, you do your skin a favor. Now, most days, as I mentioned, I don't even use anything on my face. I rarely use powder full stop, and if I want to do something, I like doing my eyeshadow. And the reason why I love eyeshadow is because I think it's awesome and there are so many different colors that you can use. So I'm just going to show you guys this palette I actually have right here. Okay, take a look at this. This is amazingly neon and you know, most people would not go this bright. I haven't even used this palette and it's brand new but I would like to use it just for artistic purposes and I would like to try it out in some videos and the reason why is because I think it could be fun now that is the one thing that I really couldn't vibe with when I used to wear makeup you know all the time every day over and over it wasn't fun anymore it became essential it became a bad habit it became a part of my life that I really wished I didn't have to do and I didn't but I felt like I had to and you know when I stopped wearing it for two years and now no more foundation and all that I learned how to have fun with it, you know, 
because that is so important. I think that's what makeup should be about. It should be about having fun. It should not be about, again, just my experience, my personal opinion. It should not be about doing it because you feel like you have to do it. You don't and you never have to, okay? Because you are perfect the way you are. And just knowing how to have fun, like you can actually learn how to use your eye as a palette, you know. Like yeah, you have an eyeshadow palette with all the colors, but you are made divine, you are the divine palette, you are made in the eyes of God, and you are God's perfect child. You do not need it as much as you may think you do, and at all. But in moderation, when you can get to that point, which I did, after two years of nothing, I got to that point where I could go out and feel empowered, knowing that I don't have to hide my skin anymore. If I want to add a little bit of highlighter on my eyebrow, on my eye, that's okay. But do I need to cake my face in it? No. You know? And that's the difference. That's what I learned. It's okay to have fun with it. It's okay to experiment. That's why I want to make makeup videos for the eyes. And although my channel is very oriented around spirituality, Reiki healing, activations, all of this will stay. Of course, because that is my calling. That is a part of my divine purpose here on earth. It is to express my gifts to help heal the planet. Another thing I like is art. And although I can do art for singing, which I do, you also have colors. And colors are so awesome. And color therapy is a thing. And the benefits are proven. I love colors and rainbow is just amazing and yeah for you beautiful souls who would like to see this comment down below and i'd also like to mention here i've got a list of points to cover <laughs> yeah like really i want to emphasize on the point not using makeup as a band aid you know like when you get a wound, you cut yourself, right, and you stick a plaster on it, well, some people do, okay, I don't really do that anymore, but when you, you feel damaged in yourself, right, when you feel like you have a lack of worth, you don't love yourself enough, it is easy to see yourself externally, as something that is not good enough because that is how you feel inside and that was one big reason why I got so attached to getting up makeup go out first thing every day and it took a lot of time and it took a look of a, a lot of healing it took a lot of a, if I can even talk right now, that would be helpful. <laughs> it took a lot of work and inner work for me to really shift that stuff, to really clear my heart and to embrace the divine essence of my beingness and others. If you feel like you may need help with this, I actually offer one-on-one -on -one Reiki healing. That's right. I'm now doing healings via call just like this. And I'm also doing light language activations one on 
one through email only, not yet videos. But if you just want some help with healing, like if you are feeling what I've been describing in this video, that sounds like you. I'm here to help. I got myself through it, so can you. It's okay to have a helping hand on the way. And that's something that I have learned. It's okay to ask other people for help. I did it. Everyone has to, at least one time in their life, when you're going through something. And when it comes to feelings of lack of self-worth, lack of self-love, feeling like you're not good enough, like you have low self-esteem, right? And you want to cover yourself in makeup every time before you go out. Trust me, you may benefit from Reiki healing. If you would like to book a healing session with myself for this or anything else at all relating to health, any things that you would like healing for, my website is in the description and you can book with me anytime, beautiful soul. I trust that you have found this video to be inspiring, to be helpful. And if you know anyone who sounds like I've described from my own experience, this may resonate with them. Just share the video. Share the love. Give the video a big like, thumbs up, and comment down below, share your feedback. What sort of awesome, artistic eye makeup looks did you want to see? Colors, whatever, you know like that sort of stuff if you don't that's okay because i will always be making content that you like as well not just tutorials with awesome colorful eye stuff okay keeping up everything else but i'm just gonna be adding things in to the channel that i personally like and obviously by doing so, we will reach a wider audience as well. So, catering for all you guys, do not worry. <laughs> and thank you again so much for all of the amazing support. Take care, you beautiful soul. If you want to support me on Patreon and get 20% discounts every single month, I'm offering 20% discount codes. For all my bookings and all my healings, 20% off, I have my Patreon. And in the Patreon, you can also get monthly oracle readings as a part of the membership. Monthly 10-minute Reiki healing as a part of the membership as well. Awesome pros to joining. And you can press join YouTube memberships. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell for any awesome future updates, live streams, and all of that cool stuff. See you in the next video, you beautiful soul. Enjoy the rest of your day, your night, and your weekend and week, and just enjoy your life. And remember, before you go, you are amazing. Just say that with me right now. I am amazing. And just repeat this mantra. And I also have confidence affirmations on the channel you can find. God bless. Take care. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.